We know you guys are our busy gals. It has been a day, y'all. My daughter graduated, graduated. She finished kindergarten today, she did not graduate. But it has been a long day, and I'm super excited to end it with you guys. Okay, so welcome to our glimpse into coaching. My name is Jessica Warren, this is Raquel McAfee, and we are going to be talking all things coaching. We are definitely here to just be open books. We have both been coaching for five years. We run Team VIP together as a unit we have for the last five years. So if you follow either one of us on social media, you probably have already seen a piece of that. And we're just going to dive in tonight and talk about all things coaching, what we do, how we make money, hesitations you may have that you're a little nervous about, you've thought about it, but maybe you've got some questions. And then we're going to answer any questions that you have. So you can pop them in the chat. If you're on your phone or computer, there's an option to chat. You can chat any questions as we're talking, or we'll also open it up at the very end for you to unmute yourself or chat in the box, whatever is more comfortable for you. Just know we are not here to convince you to coach. We are not here to tell you that this is your future dream job, and we are not here to tell you that you have to do this. We want you to be able to make a well-informed decision. We're going to give you all the facts, and we're going to give you what we have found successful on our, with ourselves and our team, and then you can decide if it's a good fit for you. So I'm going to roll it over. We're going to start by telling you a little bit about who we are and how we started, and then dive right in. So Raquel, why don't you start, and then I'll jump in. All right, so thank you for being here tonight. Again, my name is Raquel McAfee, and I have been a coach for five years. I'm gonna give you a short, condensed version of my story, but basically, I signed up as a coach in that weird time between Christmas and New Year's when you're kind of reevaluating your life. It was the end of 2014, which will go down in history, I hope. Hopefully that was like as hard as it's gonna get as the hardest year of my life. I had just had twins at January, so I had three kids, three and under, I was working full time um, and I was up to my eyeballs in motherhood. I loved my job. I loved my career. I worked at a university as an educator. I loved working with college students, but I felt like I was on a hamster wheel of life, like running around trying to do all the things. You know, when I was young and I was newly married, that double income, no kid life was awesome. Like I felt like we're rich. It's awesome. And then we had one kid and we had one kid in daycare. And if you've ever paid for daycare, it is the most expensive thing in the world. Um, and then surprise, we had twins unexpectedly. So now I had three kids in daycare and two in diapers. So our finances got very tight, very quick. So I was working um, as a way to help pay and supplement. My husband had actually had a transition that year. When my kids were six months old, he took a different career path and went into sales, which is 100% commission. And if you've ever had a sales job, there are ebbs and flows. Some months are great and some months are like, ooh, and that's kind of where we were. Um, you know, I was, we were living paycheck to paycheck. Sometimes there was more month than money. I got paid on the first. And I just remember thinking, I'm working my ass off, working 40 plus hours a week dropping my kids off at daycare for like eight and a half to nine hours a day. And then on the weekends, I was like hustling to do the grocery shopping, do the laundry, clean the house, do all the things. And I would get to Sunday night and be like, did I even get to enjoy my family? Like I've been racing around. I'm, and then I'm about to start the whole process all over again. And I remember thinking, this is not how my life is supposed to be. I'm 30 years old. I have three small kids. While I love my career, I literally have no breathing room. Like I just knew I couldn't keep that pace going forever. So I was looking for ways to earn additional income. I actually ended up taking an evening job teaching at the university. So I was away from my kids two nights a week extra as a way to supplement. I had actually tried three different at-home businesses prior to Beachbody, which is embarrassing to say, but I tell that to you because maybe that's you. Maybe you've tried something in the past and you haven't been successful. I wasn't successful mainly because I never really went all in. I kind of just dabbled. And with these types of things, you can't just dabble. Like if you're going to go all in, that's how you really see success. And what's great about coaching for me is that it is a lifestyle. Like I, it has completely transformed my life. Like I said, I had three kids and twins were some of them. And you know, my body looked a lot different and I kind of just figured this is as good as it's going to get for me, but truly the workout programs, Shakeology, our fitness plan and nutrition plan completely transformed me physically 
emotionally, I'm a much better person and a lot more patient and a better mom <laughs> prior to when I became a coach. Um, and financially, it's been a blessing. I never intended to leave my full-time job. I was truly looking to help supplement daycare and diapers. That was my goal. If I could make $500 a month, I would have counted that as success. But as this continued to grow and as my kids got a little bit older and life just keeps getting busier, I feel like it never slows down. It just gets busier. I got to the point where I had the option. My husband was like, you know, you don't have to keep that full-time job anymore, or you can cut back your hours and go part-time if you want. And so this business gave me options when my life circumstances changed. And so that's what I want to show you. You don't have to want to do this full time. And maybe you just want to have some fun money. Like I love online shopping during the quarantine. It's been a huge issue in my life. But guess what? I can do it without any guilt that I'm like taking away from the family budget. And when all the packages come, my husband isn't mad because I'm making a good income, right? It's not like I have to be like, babe, is it okay that I spent $100 at Sephora today? You know? And that sounds maybe crazy and weird and maybe you don't relate to that, but like that was important to me. I wanted to be able to get my nails done before quarantine or not. I wanted to spend money on things without feeling like I was taking away from the family budget. And so that in a nutshell is my story. If you want to know more, I can, but for the sake of time, I'm keeping it very short. Jessica, why don't you tell us a little bit about you and how you got started? Okay, so I started in 2015, and at the beginning of 2015, my oldest, who just graduated from kindergarten today, was about eight months old, and I was working a job that I loved so much. I was a general manager of a health club, so super demanding job, but I loved it because I love to work. I always have. I really identify with being successful, and I chase success. I love working hard, and I love being productive, and I love making people money bottom like I love it I love making money I love running a business all of the things I always have that's just been who I was from the very beginning every job I've ever had I made it to the top as fast as I possibly could because that's just my nature I'm a little bit competitive and I also love that like how do I get to the top and how do I be the best like I love that so I was in that position I was running a health club I loved it it was super busy 50 to 60 hours a week but it was fun for me until I had a newborn Someone said, your lashes are on point. Yes. Okay. This is also coach money. Okay. Yes. Oh, is it right off? No, just kidding. It's not. Um, but I was at a place where I had a newborn daughter. It was my first. I was breastfeeding. I was hormonal. I was crazy. I was all of a sudden trapped. I didn't have a maternity leave at all. And for those of you that have kids, you know what I'm talking about. I went back to work at four weeks full-time, went back to work at four weeks. And during those four weeks I was home, my boss, who was the owner of the health club, was so sweet to move my entire office home so that I could still do payroll and run the business while I had my first baby. And for you guys that are moms, your first baby is like a firestorm. Like it was the worst experience of my life. That really shook me. And I was like, oh no, like what am I doing how, like, what am I going to do here? Because when I was at work, I felt guilty that I was paying someone else to take care of my kid. And when I was at home, I was stressing because there were so many things going on at work that needed my attention. And I was just like caught. I didn't know what I was going to do. And I kind of freaked out a little bit. And not to mention, I was still in my postpartum body, which is no fun for anybody. I was like, Ugh, I'm just in a funk all over the place. I originally said no to this opportunity because I thought it was stupid. I thought I was above it. I thought my master's degree and my personal training certification and my big work 50, 60 hours a job was way cooler and I was way too cool for network marketing. I was like, okay, that is precious, but no. And then I started digging in and I really started looking at it and I was like, you know what? These people are like crushing it. And what I was after was a job that made me happy, left me feeling fulfilled, but I also wanted a job that made income. I wanted a strong income and I wanted to be happy in my position. And that was something that I was like, how am I gonna find that? And this opportunity provided both. It was something I could be really passionate about. I could help people, I could help myself, but there was also a big income opportunity, which is important to me because I never wanted to have to feel trapped in my income. So I started this position 
this position. I started this job, this business, and I decided to go all in. And I was like, no matter what, I'm going to figure it out. I will be successful. There is no other option. I'm not going to put my little butt on social media and fail. That's just not going to work for me. And then that was it. And I told Raquel when we started, I said, we're going all in for a year. We will not quit because we are serial entrepreneurs who have quit every business we've ever started. A little embarrassing, but true. And I said, if we start this, we're not quitting because no, we're not going to put ourselves on social media and then fail. This is something we can do. Anybody can do this if you work hard enough. And that is something we could do. So we went all in. Same thing. I had no intention of quitting my full-time job, but I was just kind of panicked and I needed something that brought me joy and just breathing room. And this just opened my eyes to so many possibilities. About a year into coaching, I had also taken on a job teaching at the university. So at this time I was working three jobs. I got to a place with my full-time job where my boss was just asking too much. She was saying I needed to be there more. I needed to make more money. Meanwhile, I'm watching him take all these vacations. I'm watching him remodel his house. I'm watching him live the life I want to live because of all the money I'm making him. And I just got to this place where I was like, no, you need to find somebody else. I'm done. I'm going to go all in over here because I know I'm capable. And I quit the very next day. I never would have had the option to quit if I hadn't already been working on this on the side. But now my boss and I are still really close. We're still really good friends. However, having the option to walk away when I would, would have been forced to stay has been everything. And that's my goal is to give people options. If you want to work, work. If you don't, don't. But give yourself options to not be stuck. And this pandemic has taught me so much as well. So many people lost their jobs, lost the ability to work, lost the ability to make income, or were forced to go into work when they didn't want to go into work because they had to pull in an income. And that really taught me that this is so important, especially now in this season. So five years later, I have retired all the jobs except for this coaching job. It's provided more than a full-time income, and it has provided more than the flexibility I dreamed of. And I hope that that is something, um, if that's what you're looking for, know it's possible. But let's dive in to the details. All right. Can y'all see the screen okay? Yeah? Okay. Jess, you want to kick us off? So that was a team picture from an annual event. We have a large team on Team VIP and we are super tight knit. So we are a super tight community. This is another picture from that event last year. Um, we love a good pink, if you can't tell. And so we always take a big group pink picture at this event, but was such a big piece of who we are is just a community of women supporting each other. If you get nothing out of this business other than you feel good in your skin, you feel healthy, you create a lifestyle you love, and a community of women who support you, you're already ahead of the game. If you never make a dime, those two things will be worth it. Who we are, we are Team VIP. We are network marketing professionals. So this is a network marketing business. Some people think network marketing means pyramid scheme, which pyramid schemes are actually illegal and no longer available. And a pyramid scheme, in case you've heard that term, would be like, I say, you're going to come on board. Like, I'm going to say, Raquel, you're going to sign up as a coach with me. You're going to pay $150 and you're not going to get anything for it. You get no product, zero product, but you should turn around and you should also get somebody to sign up for that same $150. So there's no product, there's no actual item, and they are illegal. So if anybody says, don't do that, that's a pyramid scheme. Just know that's not actually possible or legal, so you're definitely not in that. This is, however, network marketing, which means we partner with a company that's already established. We partner with a household name, Beachbody, which is the top at-home health and fitness company in the entire world. They were ahead of the at-home health and fitness like over a decade ago. They've been in this field forever and they have mastered health, fitness, and nutrition. They have the best trainers, they have the best doctors, they have the best physical therapists. Every program, every nutrition piece, everything goes through so many experts, so many trainings, so many trials before it ever hits us as coaches and launches into the market. You can feel 1,000% safe with everything you're doing by partnering with a company that's already well established. Now us on Team VIP, our mission 
through our partnership with Beachbody and the platform of health and fitness, we create an impact and income and a legacy for our family. And that depends on every coach. Every coach has a different story, a different reason, a different why, but we all have the dream to make an impact, create an income, and build a legacy. Whether that legacy is health and fitness, whether that legacy is generational wealth, whether that legacy is creating options and creating an example for our children, everybody has a different why, but together that is what our mission is as Team VIP, which is the team that you're coming on board. And we are made up of men, women. We are predominantly female heavy team, although we do have men who work the business and we have a lot of spouses. <laughs> we have a lot of spouses who are coaches who support us in our business, but we do have working men as well. And we have a couple of couple teams. So husband and wives that work together who actually work. My husband is a coach, but you will not see him on the social media selling health and fitness. He's in the background doing his thing with his camo socks on my videos, but he's supportive and he's part of the team. We are teachers, stay at home parents. We are corporate people. We are veterinarians. We are nurses, lawyers, professors, literally everything you could think of, you will find on Team VIP. All right, so just to go into a little bit about what we do. Our first priority as a coach is to focus on becoming our very best self. So when I told you I had a transformation, that was obviously physical. We are a health and fitness company. If you follow our workout programs, you follow our nutrition, you will 100% get amazing, incredible results. So that's our number one priority is to focus on our own personal journey. Um, we're committed to personal growth through fitness, through nutrition and emotional well-being. which honestly, I wasn't expecting that side of it. I realized I would get some sort of transformation physically, but emotionally, we are filling our signs, ourselves up with positivity. We're reading books, we're um, learning, we're going through training, we're listening to podcasts, things that make us better human beings. Because that's honestly our number one goal, become our best self. Because when you do that and when you start shining bright, that brings people to you. They're like, I don't know what you're doing, but you seem so excited, you seem so happy, you seem so joyful. And I will be the first to tell you, when I first looked into Beachbody Coaching, my first thought was, these people seem really happy, almost annoyingly so. There's no way that's real. 100% I thought that. From the outside looking in, I was like, mm, no way. But now that I'm in it, you can't help but feel incredible when you are working on yourself, when you are working out for 30 minutes a day in your upstairs loft, when you are filling your body up with the most amazing nutrition on the planet, and when you're filling your mind, body, and soul up with incredible resources, and you get connected to an incredible group of women. I mean, when you're with all of that, you can't help but level up. So that's first and foremost what our job is as a coach, become our best self. Second, we share our journey authentically and we share what we genuinely love. Now, I'm going to show you in a little bit what I mean by authentic versus inauthentic, but truly, this is a lifestyle. If you were to follow me, you would know I'm making it happen. I have three crazy kids. My twin boys are constantly wrestling. My house is chaotic. It's never 100% clean, but I'm showing my real life and I'm showing how I had to homeschool three kids this spring and I was still showing up for myself, for my health and fitness, for my own personal well being. And then I share what I'm doing. I share that I did a bar program at the beginning of this year that I absolutely loved. Right now I'm doing a program that's heavy lifting and has a little bit of cardio and abs. It's four days a week. I absolutely love it. It's my husband's favorite program. I'm sharing every single day. I'm drinking um, Energize, which is our all natural energy boost. You will see it on my stories literally every day because I'm obsessed and can't live without it. So I'm sharing things that I love naturally and I'm sharing that the results that I get with it. When people follow my story, they connect with who I am. Maybe we're in the same season of life. They see the results that honestly results don't lie. And then they're like, dang, what are you doing? Because you seem very happy. You've got great results. I want to know what it is you're doing. So I share and I invite people to join me on my journey because when you have something amazing, what do you naturally want to do? You want to shout it from the rooftops that this is amazing. Like I said, I had three kids and I look better now at 36 than I did 26. If I did not share that with Jessica, who is also a mom of three, I would not be a good friend, right? If I'd be like, oh, I look and feel really good. Good luck to you. I don't know what's going to happen for you after three kids. Best of luck, right? We don't do that. We naturally share and invite others to join us with what we're doing. And the third part is we teach others how to do what we do. 
we are transformation coaches. My job is to get results for myself and then turn around and pay that forward. Like I just said, turn around and teach the next mom who has a postpartum body and is unhappy in her skin how to get to that place where she feels good and confident again. And then at the same time, I share and teach other people how to make this a business. If you want to earn an income, it is my job as your business mentor to teach you how to do that. We've done this for five years. We know what works. We know how to teach people to start from literally ground zero and build a thriving business at whatever level that success means to them. That's my job. Get you a bomb transformation physically. And if you want to make and build a business and create additional income that gives you options, my job is to teach that to you as well. So that in a nutshell is what we do as coaches. Okay. So some hesitations that we commonly hear and that we had before we started that maybe makes you nervous, makes you like, yes, I want to do this, but I'm like, ooh, you have that ick factor, which we totally had. And a lot of successful coaches on our team had that too. So that puts you in great company. And that means that you care about what you're doing. So don't think that's a bad thing, but we want you to feel comfortable and know you are not alone. You don't have a big social media presence. You don't need one. When I started social media, when I started this business, my social media was nothing. I didn't have an Instagram at all. And my Facebook, literally, you saw me post when I got married and like when I had a kid and that was it. Other than that, I was just in the background stalking everyone else on social media. That was what I was doing. I was not present. I literally kid you not when I say the day I signed up as a coach on January 7th, 2015, I made a post and from there hit the ground running like it was my job because it was. On that day, it became my job to show up on social media and I never stopped. Social media has completely changed. Way back yonder in 2015, there were no stories. We were just posting. Now there's stories, there's Instagram, there's Facebook, all the things. And it really makes your job a lot easier. But when we started, it was like, hey, post on social media three to five times a day. And I was like, okay, here I go. And I didn't think, I just did it. And we will teach you how to do that too. We will, we figured it out. We have got, if you want to scroll back through our social media, Facebook 2015, and you want to see some embarrassing photos and videos, they're there for you because they were awful. Like, awful. The video quality, the way we took pictures, we had words all over them, like just in. Embarrassing. Facebook memories is an everyday humbler. Every day. Literally, we're telling that we're sending a video today that we were like, we put this out in the world and we're proud of it. Because the thing is, it doesn't matter if it's perfect. It just matters that you're excited and that you're being honest. It doesn't have to be this perfect quality. Back then, I was just excited. So I posted what I was excited about. I look back now and cringe, but at the time, you know what? That built my business. And so who freaking cares? If you're excited, people are going to be attracted to you and you're going to be able to help them. We've also worked really hard over the last five years to create training that makes it easier on you. We literally will say, here are the first 30 things we want you to post about. And here are direct examples that you can use, make it sound like yourself, recreate and go. So there is no thinking. We had nothing. We literally woke up in the morning. And we're like, what should we talk about today? And let's throw some words on it. Like awkward turtle. If we can do it, I promise you can do it and you can do it better. I'm not a fitness expert. I'm not my goal weight. Do you have to know it all? 1000% no. Like I said in the very beginning, Beachbody is the number one health and fitness company. They spend millions of dollars getting testing done, running through corporations, making sure their stuff is handled and legit before it ever hits the consumer. You don't need to do that. That's handled for you. Every nutrition meal plan that goes out, every workout that comes across your plate, every nutritional supplement that comes to your door has already been tested, approved, and like been through the ringer. All you have to do is use it, share it, love it. That's it. You don't have to know the details. You don't have to know the science. You don't have to do that. You're going to be who you are, where you are. Nobody wants to see somebody who's already got a chiseled body, perfect story, life together, has no problems. Nobody wants to follow that. They want to see the journey. They want to see the evolution. They want to see that, okay, this girl is just like me. She's a mom. She's drowning in motherhood. She's got small kids like me, but she's still making this happen. She's still creating an income. She's still taking care of her body. She feels good. She's happy. 
she can do it, I can do it. That's what people want to see. They don't want to see this like false perfect life. There is enough of that on social media. That is not where we come in. Like we are here to bring the real real, not bring the highlight real because that doesn't serve anybody and that doesn't help anybody. So don't feel like you need to be where you are. You can be starting from ground zero. Maybe you already have a transformation. Maybe you're in the middle of your transformation. I am on my third transformation while running this business. My first baby, second baby, and I am on my third. My daughter is four months old. This is my third time to go through a transformation in this business, and my business is running exactly the same. So use that to your advantage. You have a season of life for a reason. I'm not good at sales, and I don't want to push things on my friends and family. Good. If you don't want to be an icky salesperson, you shouldn't be because that's weird. Don't do that. That's real freaking weird. However, we live in a climate where it is so easy to reach people via social media when you're in the stores, wherever you might be. But think of all the ways that people sell to you every single day. That Target dollar spot, back before quarantine, that is, that Target dollar spot, how much do you spend there? Let's just be clear. They trap you. They give you all these gadgets and gadgets that you must have right then. Are you mad at them because they put that convenience in your life? And you're like, you know what? Yes, I do need 12 Easter baskets. Yes, thank you. I, I will take that. No, you're not mad at them. They're sharing something that is convenient for you. You purchase it. You're not mad at the target dollar spot. No one's going to be mad at you for sharing and helping them either. Instagram, like Raquel said, the pandemic online shopping, it's a problem. If I don't have a package at my door every day, I'm sad. And that's just, you know, that's how I'm getting through quarantine. Don't judge, but it is what it is. I'm not mad at the people on Instagram selling me all their cute crap. I swipe up all day. I'm not mad at them. I'm like, yes, I want to hear from you because you're an actual consumer who actually put the shirt on your body. You can tell me if you like it. You put the glasses on, whatever it is, and I'm buying that day because I'm out of control. I want to hear from the actual consumer. I don't want to hear from the company whose commercials have an end game. I want to hear from an actual consumer who is a girl just like me. And if she loves it, I'm going to love it. Swipe up, purchase. That is what we do. That's it. You're just sharing what works for you, what loves for you. That's another reason this is so incredible. You're not selling anything that you're not using because if you did, that would be weird and that would be icky. You're only, use, you're only selling and sharing what you're using every freaking day anyway, and you're just helping somebody else do that. So if you're worried about any of those things, don't be. We got this. All right, time to share a little embarrassment with you. So I know for a lot of people, the biggest thing is we've probably seen people in our social media feeds that have joined a network marketing company. And bless their hearts, it's like me on the left, right? You see them and all it is is they become a walking billboard for their new company that they joined. Exhibit A on the left, me with my Shakeology, I'm basically saying, I'm a billboard, buy for me. I mean, that is just so bad on so many, on so many ways. Bless my little heart, I had no training, right? So I didn't know what I was doing. That right there is not what we want you to do. We don't want you to spam. We don't want you to all of a sudden become a walking billboard for Beachbody because guess what? You're more unique than that. Yes, I have partnered with the number one at-home health and fitness company in the world, but at the end of the day, my brand is Raquel McAfee and everything that I love. I'm a mom of three. I do enjoy fitness. I also really love good reality TV. I love shopping online. I love fashion. I love learning about if it's a full moon or a new moon. I love makeup. I like, that's who I am as a person. And sprinkled in there, you're also gonna see some beach body too, because that's a huge part of who I am and things that I'm also obsessed with. But if you were to go to my feed today, it's not all gonna be beach body, beach body, beach body, because that's not what we train you to do. So the difference between what you see on the left and what you see on the right. Do you see how on the left you're like, ugh, she's selling, boom, resistance. People are already putting their hands up like, no ma'am, not interested. Versus on the right, what's happening? What are they drinking out of? They look really happy. I've created curiosity where people will then hopefully engage with me wondering what I'm doing. I don't remember what my caption said, but I did get a lot of messages asking similar things of 
Like, where did you get that mason jar? I love that uh, outdoor rug you have. Where did you get it? What's in that drink that you're drinking? Again, creating engagement, creating curiosity, creating connection. At the end of the day, I want to create connection. I want people who follow me to be excited to see what I'm doing that day. And I also want to sprinkle them with Beachbody because when they're ready to make a change with their health and fitness, because I truly believe there comes a point in everybody's life where they recognize if they're not taking care of themselves, they need to. I want myself to be the first person that they think of, but we're going to again teach you with social media. I think that's a big thing that people get so stuck up on. We're going to teach you how to do it in a way that is classy, sophisticated, and not weird, gross, spammy, or salesy. But again, just kind of want to show you where I started, and I promise we won't let you do that. <laughs> we might. Just kidding. Um, also know this. This is another hesitation before we go into training. A big thing, and especially for me too, some of the people that are closest to you, you may be nervous that they're going to judge you. You may be nervous that people on social media are going to judge you. You may be nervous that your ex-boyfriend's Aunt Sally is going to think you're weird. You may be thinking about that because we're human and that is normal. But just know this, you're putting so much good into the world and you're adding so much value to other people's life. Don't ever make a decision based off of what other people think. A, they don't pay your bills. B, you're never going to meet a hater doing better than you. Never, ever. If anybody is going to hate on anything that you're doing, they have their own problems and their own issues. It has nothing to do with you. Don't ever let that dictate your decisions. For me, some of the closest people to me thought what I was doing was so weird. They were like, okay. And I had to thicken up my skin and I had to move through that and now those people are my biggest fans they're like you're a freaking genius why that, that's incredible how did you do this but if I had just taken their opinion at face value and been like you know what they think it's weird so I'm gonna not I'm gonna keep being miserable in my life because I don't want them to think I'm weird so anything that you're nervous about whether it's posting it's starting something new it's going out on a limb it's doing something you didn't go to school for don't be we got your back 1000 percent we have been in those shoes and i promise you make a decision based off of your gut and no one else's which leads me into team vip the team that you join matters and we have been rocking and rolling for the last five years, you are not in this alone and you never will be. You are going to have access to everything we've ever created and everything we ever will create. We are constantly evolving, constantly redoing, constantly making sure that our training is top level, it works, and it matches the climate that we're in right now. We are constantly moving and changing and shaking, and we open that up to our entire downline. So whether you're signing up with Raquel and I directly, or you're signing up with someone in our downline, you will get access to everything that we create and make because we are all about sharing. Sharing is caring. This is not a business that has any competitiveness at all within our community, at all. We are here to push each other because rising tides raises all ships, and we firmly believe that, and we work very hard to make sure everyone on the team feels supported and everyone on the team reaches a level of success that they desire. We have been a top elite-ranked team, which is like, I mean, top 200 in the entire network since 2016. After our first year, we went hard and heavy and we busted our butts to get to the top of the company and we worked very hard to stay there. So just know you have a very elite team that you're joining. We take this business very seriously. It is our full-time career, even though we don't put in full-time hours, but this is our full-time career in terms of what we are passionate about business-wise and you're gonna get every piece of that from us. We will teach you how to get yourself to the top of the company, the top 0.1% in your first 90 days, if that's a goal for you. Again, everybody, there's different levels of coaching, absolutely. But if your goal is like ours, which was to make a full-time income and to really make an income that you could feel comfortable about, we will help you get there quickly. We will teach you how to earn back your initial investment, which is what we're going to talk about next. And it's just a package that you're going to use yourself. We'll get you to earn that back within your first 30 days. You're going to get one-on-one -on -one mentorship with your upline coach. So we get on calls like this all the time. I had two calls today, me and my coaches. So I get on calls like this with my individual coaches all the time. And you're going to get access to that as well because I want you to be successful in whatever capacity that is. If you want to run, I'm going to run. If you want to walk, I will walk. But you will always have access to us as your leaders. And then you're going to get support and you're going to get help and training from the entire community of Team VIP. We have a really large team, but we have a really supportive team.
So everybody has kind of their own teams and pockets within Team VIP, but the page and the community, we are one unit, we share, we care, and we all love each other fiercely. So just know the team that you're joining is going to rock your world and you're going to be stuck with us for the rest of your days. <laughs> All right, so let's talk money because like I told you, I got started in this as a way to supplement for daycare and diapers. So I wanted to know how do you earn, how teach me the nuts and bolts of this and is this a legit business? So we earn in a multiple different ways. First being retail or affiliate commission. So like Jessica said, we all have those Instagram people that we follow that we swipe up and we um, buy that cute little skirt that they were showing and then they get commission off of our purchases. It's the same thing here. When people choose to buy Energize or try Beachbody On Demand or do Shakeology or do the whole package of fitness and nutrition, when they purchase from us on our Beachbody website that Beachbody gives us, we earn anywhere from 25 to 40% commission. Awesome, great. Why not get paid for things we love and share about? I direct people to Amazon for all the things I buy and guess how much money Amazon sends me? Zero, right? This is awesome because I can share what I love and I also get compensated for it, so it's incredible. The second way in which we earn, so we have some coaches who just stay in that lane. They love kind of being like the affiliate coach, earning a little retail um, commission from people that buy from them, and they just, they're cool hanging out there. Then we have other coaches that are like, this is awesome. I love the team. I love the community. I'm getting great results. I'm helping my clients get great results. People are asking them what they're doing. There's a whole ripple effect going on. I would love to really build a more significant income. And the way that you do that is through residual income by building a team. As we help others get healthy and fit, you can build a team of others also actively helping people with their health and fitness. When you do that, Beachbody bonuses you off the success and the impact your team is making. So for instance, I personally sponsored Jessica Warren. She is a coach on my team. But when people go through and order through Jessica, they connect with her, she, they, she takes them to her website, she earns all the commission. I don't get any. But Beachbody says, hey, you've really helped Jessica build a successful team. Her team's having success. Their clients are having success. It's a ripple effect. We're going to bonus you off the success and the overall impact of your team. And in the beginning, that residual income starts out very, very small. $14 here, $28, maybe you build up to $56. But over time, again, our job, we are invested in our team and helping them succeed. Because honestly, if I sign you up as a coach in my team and you just – hang out and just want to be part of the community, awesome. But you're not going to really help us build volume and, and income as a team. Now, if you go and you be a bomb coach like Jessica Warren, you're helping, you're growing the ripple effect, you're helping people and they're helping people and they're helping people, that residual income can grow significantly. Literally, the sky is the limit. There is no cap which I don't know about you, but in my previous job, I was 30 years old and I had reached the limit on what I was capable of making. That sucked. I had my master's degree and I had hit the ceiling of what was possible. I could hope and pray for maybe a one to 3% raise each year if there was room in the budget, but it was kind of set in stone of what I could earn. With this opportunity, truly, whatever your goal is, it is possible through time, consistency, and hard work, having that long-term vision, it is possible. My first check, I'm going to be very real with you because you're here and I'm an open book. My very first check in Beachbody was $67.49. And I'll be honest, that was all for my mother. She was my first customer. Thanks, mom. My first check, that was my commission. Okay. Last week, I made over $3,000 in this business. I used to make that in one full month and I made it in a week. And I do not share that to boast or brag. Obviously, income is, in, you know, not... We don't just tell you, yes, you're going to come in and make $3,000, right? You have to work for it. You have to be diligent. You have to put in the work and consistency. This is not a get rich quick scheme. However, five years of consistently working and helping others and having that heart for serving, and that's where it's taken me. Whereas my other job, I was in it for a decade, for 10 years, and my income barely moved because I had hit the, the ceiling limit of what I was capable of earning. So again, I like to just give you real numbers because when I was looking into this, I wanted to see what was the possibility and is it legit? And the third way in which you earn is for those people that really want to take it a step further and really want to grow, want to grow as a leader, really want to build a team of leaders. As you grow in rank and leadership within the company, Beachbody's incredible. 
and they do quarterly profit sharing opportunities. So they take all the money that they earned in the first quarter and based on rank, they disperse it from there. And those range anywhere from $800 to tens of thousands of dollars, depending on what rank you are in the company. I share that with you because again, it takes time to earn, but if, you are, if your goal is to like take this all the way to the top, that opportunity is there for you as well. If you have questions on this, let me know. I love talking the finances and the money behind it because truly I have never seen a better business compensation model. All right. And just to appease corporate, Beachbody does not guarantee any level of success. It is up to you and your diligence to get the job done. Thank you. Okay, so what are your, <laughs> what are the next steps for joining us on the team? So maybe you've already done a challenge group. Maybe you already use, love Beachbody products. You know you've got that backbone. Maybe you've done nothing. You've never, like for Raquel and I, we started our business when we started the products. Like literally, I became a coach, and the very next day I posted about it, and I was like, hey, come with me. Let's do this at the same time. Maybe you're somebody coming in with already has a transformation. <laughs> my child keeps walking in with the boxing he's a monster hey you're gonna fit right in if you don't have crazy kids bothering you on calls you don't belong here literally we at least have one child always wrecking shop in this so regardless of whether you have been part of Beachbody or not you're perfect your coach starter pack, which you don't need if you already have this stuff, includes your first full access of Beachbody On Demand, which is workout access. Your first month of your natural nutritional supplements. So Shakeology, or you can do Recover and Energize. There's tons of different options, and we will send you a direct link to choose your package. There's a couple different packages, and we try to highlight and make sure that you have access to what is the best thing for your buck and what your goals are for fitness, health, and nutrition. But there's a lot of options. And then that'll range one sixty to 250 again depending on what you want but we'll send you those package options you don't pay anything to become a coach I see that moving box now I didn't realize as a small child you don't pay anything to become a coach your self getting started on your journey is opening your business so whether you actually join as a client or a coach is the same exact price it's just the avenue that you choose to do. 90% of my clients sign up as coaches anyway because it gives them a better discount, but they never have any intention of running the business because it's actually less expensive to get started as a coach in the long run because you make a discount on long-term speaking on anything else that you purchase. Next step, you're going to get a coach welcome and your first training email from us. So you will get that. You will have a coach kickstart. You will have a coach training piece in your email, and we will hit the ground running. We will go step by step at your pace. If you sit on that coach training email for three months, that's as far as you'll go, and that's okay. If you get your coach training email done in 30 minutes and you're ready to go to the next step, we'll move that fast too. So we kind of take it piece by piece because we don't want it to be overwhelming. It can be feel like, whoa, there's a lot to learn, but this is a learn as you go business, not a learn it all and then go business. You have to just decide and you have to just jump in, fail forward and just start moving. This business is not something that you can like gather all the information, sit up and read and then go. You have to just start moving and we'll take you through those steps as you go. You'll be put into our coach mentorship pod. We have a coach mentorship that is starting this Monday, June 1st. And so you'll have, and we start at the first Monday of every month. So, if it, so when you're watching this, the next Monday, the first Monday of the month is when we'll start your mentorship. You'll go into a mentorship message pod with other new coaches at the same time. So you have people that are in the same space as you, the same place in their business. They have the same questions that you have, and you'll kind of grow together as a unit for the entire month. We'll take you through four different training calls where we talk about everything. What does it mean to actually work your business? You probably see us on social media saying, we're in my business. What does that even mean? We will tell you exactly what to do in the time you have available. When we both started coaching, I worked every day at 5 a.m. And then I waited. I went to work all day. Waited until I put my baby daughter down and I would work again at night. I only had a couple of hours every day to get this job done. And most of us start that way. We will teach you how to be efficient with your time and what you're actually doing. We're going to do a call on social media, how to do social media. We're going to do a call on what your business looks like and how to build it smartly. So you're going to be more than supported in your coach training. All you have to do is take the steps that we tell you to do and you're going to be successful. Before we end, you can put any questions. Casey says her child has been screaming. Well, I feel like we have a lot of moms that are just really rocking life right now. You are meant to be this. But for real, 
If you have questions, you can unmute yourself or put yourself in the chat, but I just want you as we end this call and as we leave you, just know you are here for a reason. There is whatever you believe in, God, spirit, all the things, there's a reason that you're here. There's a reason that your gut has been pulling you to do this. There's always something bitter behind it. And don't take that lightly. Don't let that make you nervous and don't think, oh, that sounds really good, but I'm just going to go back to life as usual. There is something pulling you here. And really trust that and have faith in that because that was for us too. Like I resisted this at the beginning because I was like, oh, I mean, that's what seems to make the most sense, but no. And now looking back, I'm like, thank you, Lord, for pushing me into this. Because I literally, during this pandemic, every single day, I think I would have been forced to go back to work in a gym, which is the germiest place in all of the land, every single day while I had to come home to my newborn daughter. That would have been horrible. Horrible. Not to mention the gym would have been closed for two months and I would have had to deal with all that stress. I literally thank my lucky stars every single day that I'm in this position. And now I see why I was pushed there. So for whatever little bug is pushing you, listen to it because it's there for a reason. Okay. Any questions, comments, concerns, you can unmute yourself or you can put it in the chat. I know we came at you hard and talked a million miles an hour. We do talk fast. Well, if you don't have any questions that you want to verbalize publicly, that's okay. Feel free to message um, either one of us or whatever coach invited you. We truly are open books. And like Jessica said, we're not here to convince you. We're here to share our story and share truly what a blessing and a godsend this business opportunity has been for us on so many levels. But thank you so much for spending your Thursday night with us. And let me be the first to welcome you to Team VIP. All right, y'all have a great night. Bye, everyone. Bye, y'all.